the, the Paul Murray one, I mean, he, he's been doing this since, uh, you know, since, since they went into Adma, uh, aye, basically even before they went into liquidation, when they went into Admin, it was, uh, he was putting together the Blue Knights, wasn't he? Um, he's, he's been doing this for, what, two years now? It's like, mate, fucking gear up now. I mean, you, they obviously don't want you there. Fucking two years you've been banging on this door and they keep saying no. A big stupid, he just keeps fucking knocking on the door. Uh, let me in, let me in. Oh, we've just got a missed call here. Hold on, stay there. Somebody's just phoned us here. Hold on. Let's see who this is, mate. Stay there, John. All right, no bother. Check money. Peace, love and harmony. Put check money. Hold on. Hello. Hello. Who's that? Hi, it's Jack McCallum for the Huddle Board. I'm born a big Tim. How you doing, my man? Right, Tony, I'm just away with a cup of coffee and a slice of some delectable fucking chocolate cake that's handed. Is this going live? Live to the planet. You're talking to a crackpot and uh, a good brother out in Australia in Melbourne. John in Melbourne. An XL Scott. How you going, buddy? No, before we get any further, Tony, thanks for calling us back. We've had our differences, eh? But, eh... Uh, Thanks for calling us back. And I apologise. That's who you're speaking to, Jack McCallop. Well, the last, the last you time you came on, and it's accepted, right? The last time you came on and you asked the question, and because you couldn't sing the soldier song, I was a bit abrasive and a bit. Oh no, no! Hey, listen. <laughs> uh, the fucking question questioned. You take me as you find me. I'm the real deal. No, fair dues, mate. Yeah. Fair dues. No, but it was it was the way you asked the question and fair play to uh old Sue White because uh she recognised she she went like that, that's that Jack McCarrop for the huddle board. Cause you'd asked the same question on the huddle board apparently. And uh, I just took it the, well, the way you, Sue, the way Sue you said White's it. an absolute diamond though. Say that on there. She is a diamond. A one off. I'll give you my answer to that question you asked me however many moons ago. Aye, if you if you can see, if you were a zombie and uh, you can see the New World Order and all its guys and you're against it and you stand against it, of course I'm going to be on your side. Oh, and above, a Celtic fan of Disney here. That was and my question, because uh, I struggle with that, don't I? But, uh, what, Celtic question. fans that don't see it? Oh, me too. Aye. Would you support a zombie? How could you be a fucking zombie if you seen it? Because the zombies are the fucking essence of it. You know what I mean? Uh, but there's one or two who are enlightened in the same way there's... there's well, they've uh, got one or two uh, enlightened. There's there's a few dimwits uh, in their support. And, and, in general, though, in general, though, you know, the Queen, the Masons, all that fucking shite. Uh, but all that just... fucking stupid shite. Ah, but just because you're a, just because you support the zombies Rangers are epitomised it, man. The zombies, the zombies epitomise it. But my, my ah, question yeah, was, if you got a zombie that was enlightened, over and above a fucking ignorant Celtic fan, who would you choose to stick by in times of adversity? I'd choose the enlightened zombie. I would, I would try hard to make the Tim enlightened and work on him because. It's well, probably- it's probably if just. It be a, a, if it was, if, if, if it was enlightened, if, if it was a proper time, it'd already be enlightened. That's my point. Because see, all these cunts that control the world. Do you know what they find the most <laughs> difficult to control and why they want to wipe them out? It's Palestinians, Irish folk, Scots. It's a Celtic nation. You know, it's a, it's a fucking. I've got. A, <laughs> I have so, but don't it. I've got a wee thing in my PC here. Maybe here on the phone. That's the God particle. That's the God. That is the God frequency. I'm just going to stop it. That's what that is, though. What's the God frequency there? It's a God frequency. Five to eight hertz. Well, where's the God frequency? Your listeners heard it or you heard it, but I heard it. I was coming, I'm walking about my fucking house, man. And uh, that was the uh, music I had on the background, the God part, the, the, the God uh, frequency. Where's the God frequency? Yeah, Tommy. Do you know the anything God? about this? The what? Do you know anything? Do you, Mr. 
just a tiny bit of gargle, track box on there. Not anything about the God frequency. No, what's the God frequency? Tell me. Well, what it is, it's something that's suppressed by the powers that be, religious powers at the time, but the controlling powers at the time in the history of humanity. They suppressed it and changed it and made it 440 hertz for your standard day tuning on a guitar, so it's like. But the God particle, what the suppression hit, because this particular frequency makes humans and, and life in general feel good, was there. Uh, and it was a god frequency, and it was 528 hertz. And it equates to a C major on the guitar. So, a wee bit, a wee bit of use there for you. <laughs> that's, talking that's, about the uh, god, the god frequency. Hmm? You're talking about the yep. god frequency. A, well, you might laugh. Yeah, you might fucking laugh. But that's uh, historically documented. And um, if, you, if you check it out, I'm just talking about it. I'm just talking about it. Makes, I'm just posting. I'm just. And I'm just posting. No, I'm, it does, mate. I'm just posting it on uh, the huddle board the now. Uh, so it's people. I go for it because it's it, it's all good stuff, and the more people that do it and uh, promote it, uh, it's boring, but it's good, and the more people that alert and and a lot of people to the. To the fact of the matter, John, 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 hold on, John, down in Australia, have you heard of the God frequency, John? No, I have not. Um, I was just trying to think about what you, what your boys were talking about there uh, when Jack was describing it. But I, I got a wee bit lost there. I thought you were talking about a radio frequency or something. I thought no, we got a, a direct line into God. I was a, I was away to see if I can do a, a, a three way well we're doing a three way call. I was away to see if I can do a simulcast with the God frequency. I was away to see if I can get tuned in. Now tell me, right? I mean, I I try to do my prayers. I'm supposed to do it five times a day, right? And and you know, but, but how do you get tuned into the moon at four seventy? How do you get tuned into it, Jack? Tell me, how do you get tuned in? What, how have I not heard about this before? Oh, it... and why would you want to? And how do you? Why would you want to? But the thing is, though, see, you know, it's a double-edged sword. Mm. Right? No, you, you, I, hold on, I'm not dismissing you. Hold on, before you go on, I'm not dismissing you. You know, right? Be, because okay. uh, see, see, For instance, see, religion. Let, let, let's 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 talk about religion. It's all the same fucking god. Um, different stories behind it all. Different. Uh, amounts of what you know, what you can verify, authenticity. It's all the bullshit. It's ancient controlling mechanisms foisted upon, you know, the poor, simple, proletariat, fucking human being walking the planet. And people need to see through it all, <coughs> get together, and take on the you know the real. The real fucking enemy, because it's worldwide now. It's worldwide now, and I almost probably always was. But it's worldwide now, and it's time everybody woke up. Fucking stop boring about stupid fucking you know fictional media, and realised how interesting real life is, and took it on board and looked and seen what was happening to us all. Because you know it could you know it could be a lot better than what it is. And it fucking pisses me off. But uh, God fearing atheist, um, I, 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 I agree with what you were saying there, Jack. I think religion is just a form of control that's been there since the beginning. It's all it is. Um, but the, the whole, the whole system is just completely fucked. How the fuck can you be a God fearing atheist? What the fuck's that all about? You mad bastard. <laughs> We've had a tongue in cheek there, uh, Tommy boy, but I was brought up, I was brought up uh, a devout uh, Catholic. Uh, my whole family's very religious. My father's very religious. Um, I, I I gave up on it in, in my mid teens somewhere. I uh, got very disillusioned with it, and um, yeah, I, 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 I don't know. I just I, I don't believe it. There's an all powerful, almighty being that created the universe. I, I Strongly believe that you know everything came about. Um, all by all by was a fucking bricks and mortar type of guy. 
he did what he took to survive and keep his family going. Skin all his days, worked his cunt out. An absolute fucking one hour. Oh dear, bit of esoteric loot and stuff and that, and, uh, you know, not a good person. I, 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 I believe most people are generally good. Most people basically are generally good. We're all getting fucked, mate. We're all getting fucked, mate. It's time to fucking realise it and woke up. It's not NFL hat. It's not fucking, you know, bloody stupid stuff. Let's credit each other with some intelligence here. We are getting fucked. We're getting fucked. It's time we fucking done. And we have been since they thought, mate. And this is me speaking to you, right inside the planet Tartara. And uh, we are getting fucked. Come on. Let's wake up and fucking see 100%. it all. But give us mobile phones. Give us mobile phones. The wee small print at the back is, might cause cancer. Happy New Year. How oh, we have a nice Christmas. Wake up, folks. We're getting fucked. You may be getting fucked, but someone has never had a hole in fucking months. Fucking what well, well, I can do? I can't do much. I'm it, fucking scant. I have no power over no cunt. But I know what's going on. And anything I can do to stop it will be done. And that may be boring and tedious to some people, but it's essential. And you may be getting fucked, but some of us have no had a hole in months. I mean, fucking think about somebody else. I'm not getting a fucking uh, king. You speak for yourself. You're getting fucked. Whatever you're getting fucked, you may be getting fucked. But fucking hell, have a thought at Christmas for those cunts that are fucking not getting it. Know what I mean? Oh man, I'm in a weird position here. I need to put this phone in for one minute to roll a five. I'll pick it back up. I'm cutting you off, friend. I'll be back in a minute. Well, I'm cutting you off, right? I'll phone you back in five. Right? We'll take a break. Then we'll get. John, phone is back, right? Or oh, somebody else is fucking phone in here. I phone you all back, right? Hang up, man. My head's busting. Who's this? The fucking God particle. The God frequency. Fucking. Do you know what? I, I remember what I did once to somebody. I changed the name. What you should do, right, for a giraffe? Change your name. You go to somebody who's got your the phone, give me your name, and change it. And put in it God and phone them up. I just go, hello, hello. We're going to do one more song this time. Right. And, uh, one more song. I need a break day. here. Right, so, as Jack McCarrop, as Jack McCarrop goes for his one skinner, he's away for his smoke. Right, that's his take a break time from crackpot time. So we've got John out in, uh, I was going to say the Middle East, John out in Melbourne, out in Australia. We've got Jack McCarrop for the huddleboard, away for a smoke. And we've got the orange men trying to walk down Gavaki Road. And I'm away to find out where this God frequency is. Because we were to do a, we were to do a simulcast here. We're doing a simulcast with the God frequency. With Jack McCarrop and John from Melbourne. And the spirit of freedom. The fields of Och Nacloy. Of Och Nacloy. You won't be marching down your Vahey Road. No you fucking won't if you're a hun. If you enjoyed yourselves, go out and tell your friends that you've heard the spirit of freedom. If you didn't like us, we're called the Progressive Democrats. So you can take out that whatever you like. Want to hear you joining into a song called The Fields of Ocknacloy or you won't be marching down your Vahey Road. <laughs> <laughs> 